the foundation of discipline are healthy habits. And for building habits, you need to have daily routines. Per definition, you need to follow a sequence of actions regularly. Actions that are very enjoyable at first. Actions that will improve your life. Actions that will make you not just someone. Hey, my name is Marius and I'm on a journey towards becoming the best version of myself. AKA becoming not just someone. And while simple routines like making my bed early in the morning was challenging at first, I eventually picked it up and did it soon without even thinking about the action. But there are more difficult tasks out there than making your bed, working out, journaling and battling with your past, present and future, reading on a daily basis, eating healthy, but also studying or working can and probably will be a daily struggle. Every act you have never done consistently starts with failure, progresses in small steps and eventually, if pursued with patience, ends in victory. The beginning might be hard, but by building up momentum, everyone can claim their life as their own. The foundation is the will to put in the work and to study. There's this goal by Earl Nightingale, which goes like, One hour per day of study in your chosen field is all it takes. One hour per day of study will put you at the top of your field within three years. Within five years, you will be a national authority. In seven years, you can be one of the best people in the world at what you do. Soon, you will be more structured and organized, efficient and effective, and one day putting in the work that is necessary to become the best version of yourself. It's as easy as making your bed in the morning. To work on yourself means you just laid the first brick for a brighter future. All of that starts by working in routines. To make your life easier, there are simple techniques you can use right now to be able to work as long as necessary and to build routines quickly. One helpful technique was created by Francesco Chirillo in the late 1980s. The so-called Pomodoro technique breaks down a study period in 25 minute long sessions with following 5 minute breaks. With this study technique it is possible to study for many hours a day. Personally I was able to study up to 16 hours a day which you can see in my old study with my live streams. In those we tend to go for double Pomodoro sessions, which means we work for 50 minutes straight with a following 10 minute break. So if you need some extra motivation, join me and 500 more people to study with and build the foundation of becoming not just someone aka the best version of yourself. And don't feel intimidated by our long study days. I personally have started with regular Pomodoro sessions and repeated them 4 times. Everyone has their limits and yours might not even be at 50 minutes. After studying in sessions, break down your tasks in the smallest steps possible. Taking one step at a time will always be easier than taking in five step at once. Simple examples you can use right now would be to go through a chapter you need to revise and structure it into subchapters. Those again have sentences that you can work on one by one. All while reading instead of setting yourself the goal to finish a few chapters today start by reading just one or maybe if you're still struggling with being focused just read a single page. Step by step one by one. Raise your pen and begin right now. Just remember routines can be easy to build if you make them easier to build.